begin with a big week for the UK football team and fans. The Cats are 4-0 and and getting ready for the Florida Gators. Anna Tarullo from BBN Tonight joins me now. And Anna, let's start with the Cats getting it done on the road with that win over South Carolina. That's right. Turnovers abound, but Kentucky still manages to pull out the W in Columbia, exiting September 4-0, 4-0 overall and 2-0 in conference play for just the second time since 1977. Kentucky handled their business on their first road test this season. Defense showed up big and the run game was critical for UK bringing home the dub. Kentucky started hot ending their first drive in a 15 yard Kvasier smoke touchdown right there and they went into the half up 10 nothing. Despite some bad positioning defensively because of Kentucky turnovers, Brad White's side of the ball is still dominated. All right, back to those turnovers. Still a capital B I G issue for Kentucky. They have a negative nine turnover margin on the season and somehow still managed to produce a 4-0 record. Josh Ali fumbled twice, Chris Rodriguez added two more, and ball security is a major issue looking ahead, which we'll get to in just a minute. We're going to forgive C-Rod, though, because he's been the best running back in the SEC, leading the conference with 520 rushing yards. He had 144 on Saturday. But my gold star of the game goes to kicker Matt Ruffalo, whose three field goals Field goals boosted the Cats to the 16-10 win, and Kentucky has now beaten South Carolina seven of their last eight meetings. And Anna, the Cats have a big test this Saturday when they host the 10th-ranked Florida Gators at Kroger Field. That's right, one of the biggest home games in recent memory, and it's a night game with kickoff set for 6 p.m. So from before the start of the season, we said if Kentucky could just get to the Florida game 4-0, that game will be huge. Well, here they are. The Gators enter Saturday's game 3-1 overall, 1-1 in the SEC. After beating Tennessee on Saturday, their lone loss coming to Alabama. For the first time since 2007, Kentucky and Florida will be a ranked matchup. The Cats showing up in polls for the first time this season. The USA Today coaches poll has Kentucky ranked 23rd and the Gators ranked 9th. Kentucky still not receiving. They're still receiving votes in the AP, but they haven't cracked that top 25. But if you're looking for tickets to the game, good luck. This morning it was nearing a sellout at Kroger Field. Saturday's game will also be a blue-white theme, so make sure to check your seats so you wear the right color at Kroger Field on Saturday. Kroger Field will be rocking. Now, Kentucky men's soccer team hit the road this weekend to take on the defending national champions. That's right. The number 10 Wildcats traveled to Huntington, West Virginia to take on number 5 Marshall, and they held the herd scoreless for the first time this season. Sunday's matchup ended in a scoreless draw after two overtime periods, and the shutout was the fifth of the season for first-year UK goalkeeper John Hoffelner. That's now two games ending in 0-0 draws for Kentucky against ranked Conference USA opponents. Kentucky remains undefeated at 5-0-2 as they dip back in a non-conference play this Wednesday at 7 p.m. at Dayton. And finally, volleyball, seventh ranked Kentucky opening SEC play at home with a sweep of Missouri. That's right. And a lot of that was thanks to Allie Stumbler. She brought it on both sides of the ball. She ended the match with a double double. That's 10 kills and 10, 10 digs. All three sets were tight with UK trailing at the halfway mark and all three against the Tigers who have struggled so far this season. Kentucky came back to manage big points late to pick up the 3-0 win over Mizzou and the reigning national champs move on to eight and three, one and zero oh on the season. Kentucky's back in action on Wednesday in Oxford, Mississippi, taking on Ole Miss. Be sure to join Keith Farmer and myself tonight and every weeknight at 7:30 for BBN tonight on your official station for Big Blue Nation. LAX 18 will have all the Kentucky Florida, Florida content you could ever want or need <laughs> to get you ready for this weekend. Jennifer, back to you.